This color printed map was published in U.S. by Caxton Corporation in the 1880s. Chinese American Zheng Yingjing bought the map from a flea market in 2014. Zheng believes that a map which divides countries by different colors can prove that the Diaoyu Islands are part of the Chinese territory. The blue map is more than China. At that time, it was much bigger and more extensive. 而且呢，就是还有一个特点呢。当时我们还去考虑到，就是除了这这个钓鱼岛这个位置啊，一点点啊，它的绿色跟这个日本的那个是完全不同。Zheng has kept looking for other old maps to prove China's lawful reclamation of the Diaoyu Islands. Not long ago, he found another map from a private collector, published in 1861 by the British press. The map made detailed notes and labels on the East China Sea. 这个是，你看到没有啊？后一横啊，平再一横，修啊。这个是对他当时这就是是对这一片的称呼啊，这个称呼。现在个挑优秀呢，如果我当然听的音呢，现在挑一岛的有点发音有点比较，它是比较接近这个，而不是这个。名字是一个很有说服力的名字。为什么英文标注的名字是按中国的意音来标注？这点很能说服人心。而且它这个经纬度和那个和那个坐标，南北坐标，它把钓鱼岛的方位表示的非常清楚。Zeng believes that the English names of the Diaoyu Islands during the 19th century revealed its true identity. 